let us solve one more problem. Prove that 1 plus cos of a minus b into cos c upon 1 plus cos of a minus c into cos b equals to a square plus b square by a square plus c square. So, regarding to this problem, it had better to change cos c in terms of cos of a plus b and cos b in terms of cos of a plus c using the condition a plus b plus c is equal to 180 degrees. So, then easily we can solve this problem using sign rule. So, let us solve it now. Left hand side. So, that is nothing but 1 plus cos of a minus b cos c upon 1 plus cos of a minus c cos b. As we have planned, let us change the cos c. So, this cos c is nothing but minus cos of 180 degrees minus of a plus b. So, this is we can write it c is equal to 180 minus c. So, otherwise you can write like this also with the better we have this a plus b plus c is equal to 180 degrees we can write c is equal to 180 degrees minus of a plus b ok. Now, apply cos c on both sides cos c equals to cos of 180 degrees minus of a plus b it is very important the cos of 180 degrees minus theta equals to minus cos theta. So, this is very very important step. Using this now cos c can be written as minus cos of a plus b. So, this result we will get it. Similarly, this cos b we can show minus cos of a plus c. So, now this left hand side can be written as 1 plus cos of a minus b multiplied by minus cos of a plus b. Let's check it correct? Yes, cos c is replaced by minus cos of a plus b. Next upon 1 plus cos of a minus c multiplied minus cos of a plus c. Now, it can be rewritten as 1 plus into minus minus cos of a minus b cos of a plus b upon plus into minus minus 1 minus cos of a minus c to cos of a plus c. Cos of a minus b into cos of a plus b is the one of the formulae in compound angles we have discussed. So, this is nothing but cos square a minus sin square b. So, we can write 1 minus of cos square a minus sin square b upon what is cos of a minus c into cos of a plus c? Yes, you are correct that is nothing but cos square a minus sin square c. So, 1 minus cos square a minus sin square c. So, let it be simplified now. Now, we can simplify.
1 brackets of minus cos square a minus into minus plus sin square b upon 1 minus cos square a minus into minus plus sin square c. Now we have one formula that is 1 minus cos square a. See 1 minus cos square a is nothing but sin square a. So now it is replaced by sin square a, it is also replaced by sin square a. Now we get sin square a plus sin square b sin square a plus sin square c. Check it, the answer should be in terms of a and b only. So, apply the sin rule. Sin a is equal to a by 2 r, sin b is equal to b by 2 r, sin c is equal to c by 2 r. Using these three values, we can write this one in terms of a and b, so that we get our answer, our a. So, that means sin square a means a square by 4 r square, sin square b means b square by 4 r square upon a square by 4 r square plus c square by 4 r square, am I correct? Now, 4 r square LCM, a square plus b square upon 4 r square LCM, a square plus c square, 4 r square, 4 r square cancel, this equal to a square plus b square by a square plus c square which is RHS.